Positioned where the Atlantic and the Caribbean meet, Antigua and Barbuda is a small island country known for its stunning beaches, crystal clear waters and rich history. With a population of about 100,000 people and an area of around 440 square kilometers, this colorful twin nation faces a pressing challenge in its quest for a cleaner and more sustainable energy future. And that's because the country is highly dependent on imported fossil fuels for electricity generation. While the network has improved recently, Antigua and Barbuda still seem to experience frequent voltage fluctuations and power outages. And as electricity generation comes entirely from fossil fuels, oil is used extensively, leaving the country vulnerable to rising fuel prices and to supply disruptions besides the high CO2 emissions. This oil is very common in tropical islands, which usually have the highest cost of electricity in the world. But what is the way forward? How can nations like Antigua and Barbuda walk into a cleaner path with lower costs for power generation? Well, the solution is right here, Ocean Thermal Energy Conversion, or OTEC, which holds great potential to transform Antigua and Barbuda's energy landscape and provide a more sustainable future. As the surface temperature of seawater in the country varies from 25.8 to 28.5 degrees centigrade across a year, and that 1,000 meter deep water is approximately 5.6 degrees centigrade, that temperature difference is perfect for an OTEC system to run. A study conducted by the National Renewable Energy Laboratory has revealed that OTEC has the potential to satisfy up to 80% of the country's electricity needs, reducing both greenhouse gas emissions and the reliance on fossil fuels. With the technology developed here at Global OTEC, a floating OTEC platform is positioned at a fair distance from coast, protecting the country's landscape. And as the cycle can run day and night during the whole year, there is more reliability in power generation. Currently, the country experiences frequent power outages due to various factors, including equipment failure, maintenance issues and natural disasters. Speaking of that, hurricanes can cause extensive damage to the electricity infrastructure leading to prolonged power outages. In 2017, Hurricane Irma caused widespread power outages in Antigua and Barbuda, leaving many communities without electricity for several days. As part of the pan-European consortium PLOTEC, we're developing a more resilient OTEC structure with simulations from storm data collected in the Caribbean. This will prevent power supply disruptions on tropical islands after severe weather events meaning the population won't be left again for a long time without electricity. OTEC offers not only a cleaner energy source, but also the promise of economic growth and improved resilience for this island paradise. We are really excited to bring OTEC to Antigua and Barbuda. Share with us where you are from. Maybe your country can be featured next.